Good morning, children. How are you? Are you fine? Very good. All of you open your EVS workbook volume 2. Open your EVS workbook volume 2, page number 4. Open your workbook, page number 4. Mention few uses of water in each category. Amma, we have to write the uses of water in each category, in domestic. Domestic uses. Drinking. Bathing. Washing clothes. Washing clothes, utensils, washing clothes and utensil and uh, utensils, toilets and cooking. These are for the domestic uses. We use water for the domestic uses. Next. Agriculture. We use water for agriculture. Agricultural. Irrigation. Irrigation. Rear livestock. Rear livestock. Aquaculture. Aquaculture. Come to your notes. Next, I'm rubbing this side. Domestic uses. Next, industrial uses. Industrial uses. Power plants. Power plants. Power plants, paper mills, water is used for these different industries, leather industries, water is used in different situations, leather industries, Leather industries, making of salt, making of salt to run water, water mills, to run water mills. These are the industrial uses. Next, environmental uses. Environmental uses. Water cycle to create to create artificial habit habitat to create artificial. Habitat, habitat, wildlife, wildlife, conservation, wildlife, conservation, 
wildlife conservation complete your notes Next, transportation. Next for transportation. 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 Seas. Rivers. Canals, waterways, to transport goods, to transport goods and passengers, and uh, passengers. Next. Recreation. Next, recreation. Recreation. Getting fun. Recreational. Swimming. Swimming. Fishing. Swimming. Fishing. Sailing. Surfing, surfing, water rides, water rides, Next, according to you, sorry, Nana, fill the boxes with the words that represent the three states of matter and the earth. The three states of matter here solid, solid means uh, ice, ice is turning to liquid, means. Water. These are the reversible changes. Next, gas means vapor. These are the three changes. Solid, ice, liquid, water, gas, vapor. These are the three forms of water. Next. Already it was said. Page number 5 already said. Page number 5 in the previous class already check this out. Okay. See the video of before. Next. Uh, page number 6. Uh, this first answer is said. Uh, now I am giving these answers. Okay. Few terms related to what cycle are given below. Explain them in brief. First one is evaporation. 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 
in this process in this process liquid surface in this process liquid surface water changes water changes into into water vapor water changes into water vapor the water cycle the water cycle begins with the the water cycle begins with this stage the water cycle begins with this stage next next one is condensation next one is condensation evaporation and the condensation this is a process of this is the process of a, this is a process of water vapor this is a process of water vapor changing into changing into liquid water vapor changing into liquid when the water vapor when the water vapor when the water vapor in the atmosphere when the water vapor in the atmosphere when the water vapor in the atmosphere becomes cooler becomes cooler tiny droplets tiny droplets tiny droplets of water tiny droplets of water are formed amma have you completed first answer i'm going to be evaporation right tiny droplets of water are formed are formed into clouds into clouds what is the condensation this is a process of water vapor changing into liquid means water when the water vapor in the atmosphere becomes cool tiny droplets of water are formed into clouds means water vapor changes into water water droplets next precipitation precipitation at this stage at this stage the clouds are the clouds are at this stage the clouds are filled with the the clouds are filled with the water droplets filled with the water droplets release water release water back release water back to the earth 
to the earth. In this form, in the form of rain, in the form of rain, are hail, are means hail means fog, a snow. Amma, what is precipitation? Here, in the in the process of condensation, sorry, in the process of condensation, the clouds may form. In the process of condensation, the clouds may form. In the precipitation, the clouds, the clouds may come to the earth in the form of rain. At this stage, the clouds filled with water droplets release water back to the earth in the, in the form of rain or hill sorry rain or hail or a snow okay amma in the precipitation process we got the rains evaporation means water changing into water vapor condensation means water vapor changing into droplets all the droplets are collected at the clouds in the form of clouds in the precipitation the clouds may give back the water to the earth in the form of rain. Abide your notes. Next, infiltration, next one is infiltration, next one is infiltration. After precipitation, after precipitation, after precipitation, some of water, some of rain water, some of water, rain water seeps into the, seeps into the ground. Seeps into the ground to become groundwater. To become groundwater. To become groundwater. This is known as this is known as. Persolation, this is known as persolation or infiltration, sorry, infiltration. This process is called a persolation or a infiltration. Infiltration after precipitation, some of the rain water seeps into the ground to become groundwater. This is known as persolation or infiltration. Okay. The ground may seep the water. It is in the form of groundwater. Next one. Accumulation. Last one is accumulation. At the surface, 
sorry, sum of the rain water, sum of the rain water, sum of the rain water, sum of the rain water on the earth surface, on the earth surface. Some of the rain water and the earth surface flows into flows into streams. Flows into streams. Flows into streams, rivers, and the seas. As run off, as run off, as run off. This is called a. This is called a collection. This is called a. Collection or accumulation or accumulation Some of the rain water on the earth surface flows into streams, rivers and seas as runoff. This is called the collection or accumulation. Come to your notes Rana. Today's class is complicated. Bye.